benefit cost analysis is one of the most important tools in economics. It's a tool that is used to assess initiatives or projects, and this could include future potential projects or past completed projects. It's an extremely flexible tool and it's also extremely widely used. The essential question addressed by benefit cost analysis is, do the overall benefits of a project exceed the overall costs? This sounds simple, but it can be very challenging to answer. One of the reasons it's challenging is that it often requires a lot of information to be brought together. And it needs this information to be collected and consolidated in a systematic and logical fashion. It may also require the person doing the benefit cost analysis to work closely with the relevant body, the body that's actually proposing the project, so that they can get the information needed to do the BCA. BCA is helpful for supporting decisions because it provides a systematic, transparent and evidence-based approach. However, it should not be thought of as providing a simple prescription for a decision because there are often other considerations that come into play, such as who will pay for the project. Finally, benefit cost analysis often goes by a range of different names that all refer to the same thing. If you're reading textbooks or articles about benefit cost analysis, you might see it referred to or written in any of these six ways, benefit cost analysis or cost benefit analysis, with a range of different punctuations, but they all refer to the same basic tool. Key points, BCA supports good decision making. It does this by comparing the benefits of a project with its costs. It can often require quite a lot of information, but the strength is that it uses a systematic and a logical approach.